What's up guys, it's The Amateur out here in Las Vegas. We're down in the heart of the city on the Las Vegas Strip. Um, gonna go ahead and do a quick video here to show any of you drivers out there that are not totally familiar with driving Uber or Lyft around the Las Vegas Strip how to do a proper uh, passenger drop-off or pickup at the Flamingo Hotel Casino Spa down here on the Las Vegas Strip because if you rely on the navigation in your Uber Lyft account or even if you rely on a third-party navigation like I do sometimes um, like Waze it will take you to the wrong place okay it will take you it will get you to the property but it will direct you to go into um, what's this guy doing it will take you to it will direct you into the valet area which you don't want to go to all right, because that's valet only. You can get to it, but that's where navigation is going to take you. You don't want to go to valet only. You want to go to where you can drop off or pick up hotel guests. So let's get into the video right now. Um, I'm going to show you how to get there from the Las Vegas Strip. If you're exiting the freeway, you'll be probably getting off at, depending on where you're coming from, you'll probably be getting off at Flamingo. And, oh my gosh, I have drivers in front of me doing all kinds of crazy stuff like they do down here around the strip and around the casinos. So like I was saying, you're going to be uh, probably exiting the 15 mile, freeway turn right. by way of Flamingo. When you get off on Flamingo, the navigation is gonna tell you to turn on the strip. You're not gonna do that. You're gonna continue on Flamingo past the strip. And I'm gonna show you guys right here in just a moment. We're coming up to the strip right now. So let's do this. All right, so right now we're on the Las Vegas Strip. We're heading northbound. Uh, we're just across the street from Bellagio over here on the left. All right, there's the Bellagio. And we're coming up on Flamingo. So Flamingo is coming up here, heading in this direction, um, northbound on the Strip. We're gonna go right on Flamingo. We're not gonna continue straight on the Las Vegas Strip like the navigation will take you. Um, also, if you're coming from Flamingo, uh, if you exited the freeway coming from Flamingo, it's going to try to tell you to make a left on the strip. You're going to ignore that. You're going to continue straight because we're going to make a left where the link entrance is. And that's going to loop us around to where we can get into the proper drop off for the Flamingo. right on Flamingo. We're going to get into the left lane. In a quarter of a mile, turn left now and then right. turn left. Now she's got it right. In 0 0.1 mile, turn left and then turn left. We're supposed to be in the left lane on that turn lane because you want to make this first left. So don't do like turn me. Left. Don't be in the outside turn lane there because we're going to make this very first left again here. See, there is a little sign way up there on the building. It says Flamingo Las Vegas guest parking, um, but it's hard to miss. I mean, it's easy to miss. It's hard to see, especially when you're trying to pay attention to all the pedestrians and everything down here and all the traffic. So we're going to make, a, make this left here when it's our turn. Point one mile, 
keep right straight through this stop sign here watch out for these speed bumps and these speed bumps are nasty by the way if you're going to Hilton Grand Vacations that's on the right there it's an immediate right into there but we are going straight And the navigation will sometimes take you to this valet only turn in here. This is where myself, the amateur, used to always drop people off because the navigation would take me here. That is not the right spot. And they might yell at you if you drop your passengers off there. So you keep going straight, keep going straight. Watch it for pedestrians. Keep right. And you got these people here. Talk to your pedestrians, people. Talk to your talk to your pedestrians, wave them on, make sure you make eye contact with them or whatever, at least hand gesture them so they know what's going on. Don't get in the taxi lane, that's on the far right there. We're gonna keep going, stay in the left lane here. We're gonna keep going straight. This will loop us right into the drop-off pickup area for the Flamingo. This is a one-way loop, so you can only go one way around this thing. And these people aren't watching where they're going. This is where you can drop off and pick up right in this area here. But since we're not really dropping anybody off or picking anybody up right at this moment, we're just gonna do a little loop. You can pull up along here to you have reached it's safe your destination. To pick up and drop off. And then when you leave, we're just going to exit out the same way we came in pretty much. Out of this loop. And then to get back out of this uh, cluster down here, you're just going to keep going straight. We're going to make a right out of here. Keep watching the video if you want to see the exit out of this area. Otherwise, if you guys just want to know where to drop off or pick up, you guys are done. But we're going to continue with the video here on how to exit out of this mess. See over here on the left, this is the valet only area that I told you the navigation, ways, Uber, Lyft always take you into this one. This is not the right one to go to. Now there's a little there's a little street up here we can cut through to get back to Flamingo so we don't have to go all the way through a bunch of extra traffic. I'm going to show you guys that one. See, if you continue straight, there is a way out up there, but I want to see if I can get down this little street right here. Take a look. That guy's going down, so it's probably open. Sometimes it's kind of crammed with vehicles, but if it's not, you can take a peek down it. Yep, it looks good to go. We're going to cut through this little side street. This will avoid some traffic back there by the link, and this will direct us back out onto Flamingo, where you can access the Las Vegas Strip, and you can keep continuing straight past the strip if you're going to get onto the freeway. So that's going to do it for this video, guys. Thank you for watching. Um, I'll be putting some more videos up as I am down here on the strip, picking people up, dropping people off at some of the other properties that might be uh, more difficult to get in and out of. This is the Amateur signing off from Las Vegas. And uh, subscribe if you guys haven't yet. Click on the bell icon if you want to be notified the next time I post a video. And click thumbs up if you would. Thanks for watching. And I'm trying to pull out here onto Flamingo. But here we go. Back into the mess, back into the gridlock here. 
Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.